richardbankerwebdesign.com. Today we're looking at the Ignite Gallery component. And the way we're going to do, we're going to go through the initial setup of this and get it showing up on your front page. So I'm going to start by going to Components and then I'm going to my Ignite Gallery. Now we're just going to do something simple here. The first thing we're going to do is we're going to set up a profile. And in that profile, this is where all of your settings are saved. So I'm just going to call it General. And in here is where you control absolutely, you know, most things to do with how your gallery is being shown. So you can assign a different profile to each of your galleries that you have and they will display differently depending on the profile. I'm doing absolutely nothing to it. I'm just calling it general. This is just getting everything set up. Uh, then we're going to go to categories and we're going to create a new category. And we're just going to call it general as well. And I'm going to make sure that it's published. Now we're going to do nothing with that one either. Just complete bare bones basic. We just want to see what's going to happen when we set this up. Okay, so now we can add some images. So the first thing we can do, we look and we're just like, okay, I want to upload images. Where is it? And this should be a little more obvious right here. Please select a category to upload an image. I'll check, click on General. And here we can see that we can drag files. Awesome. So I am going to create another category first. So I want to have my general one, but the way that they do their menu items, we are going to want to have several ca several albums within this. So we're going to create a new category, and I'm actually going to put it inside the general one. I'm going to call it Christmas. It's almost Christmas time, and we're going to put it inside general. Or you can put it in top, it doesn't matter. I'm just going to show you the difference. So here we have Christmas is within general, and I forgot to publish it, so I can click publish here. And now, right from here, we also have the option to manage images. So if we click on the manage images tab from there, it automatically selects our category, and we just have to drag our files here. So I am going to select some Christmas that I have. These are just random stock photos. And I'm just going to drag and drop them. And then I have to click Start Upload. Now it'll go through and it'll upload each of the images and drop them in there. And while it's doing that, you can have some coffee. Right on. We're done. So now you can see we have each of our images here. Now with each of these images we have the option of making it the menu image. So if I click on this little star, now this will be my menu image and I'll show you what that means right away. File name, how big it is, you can edit your description, your tags and your image link as well as rotate your photo if you have to, is it published and you can change the ordering in this column right here. So the next thing we'll do is we're going to go to our main menu. And I don't think I have, I do not have Ignite Gallery added to my main menu yet. So I'm going to go New. So we are here we have our Ignite Gallery menu. And we're going to select the menu type and we're going to search for Ignite Gallery and Display Category. Then we have the option, you can see here, we have General or Christmas. Now, if I want to create a collection of categories, I have to uh, go about it this way. So now everything within General, had I just put Christmas on top, I wouldn't be able to display both of them. I could only display one. But by having it this way, with the categories as subcategories of a main category, I can now display multiple. I hope that makes sense. Uh, yes, 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 yes. Page title. We'll change this. Nope. And go 
save and close. So now when we go on our home page, our beautiful home page, you can see our Ignite Gallery here and when we click on it we have our Christmas category. Now you notice that before we went in here and we said that we wanted that to be our menu image. If I click on this star now, you can see I selected the second image. It changed to that image. So that's how you control which one is displayed here. And this is how it is displayed. You can go through and click on them. So if I wanted to add more images, I would just go into my components, go to my Ignite Gallery, click on my images, select the category, in this case Christmas, and then I can drag and drop files right into here. can see down here it's it's all ready to go. Let's see if that shows up on the front. And there we go. That's a quick very general overview of the Ignite Gallery component and uh, there's so much more that you can do with it. If you have any questions or you want a tutorial video or if you like this video please share it. Uh, share the channel, subscribe. We appreciate watching all of this. If you have any questions, leave them in the comments below. Uh, thank you. Have a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year.